My name is Clint Foreman. I'm the second flutist here in the BSO. Uh, this is my 10th season in the orchestra. So I started here in 2011. Um, I love playing in the BSO. It's been one of the greatest pleasures of my life. Um, this is the kind of job that every musician going through school <laughs> dreams of having. Uh, when I, the day that I won the audition here, I literally could not believe it for about four days. I thought it was some sort of dream until, uh, until I guess the stress dream started. And then I realized that I actually had to come play here and be as good as all these people that I've been uh, idolizing for many years. Um, and it turns out they're actually very nice people. Um, and I enjoy every second of it. Yeah, I think the work that speaks to new beginnings for me this week is the Firebird Suite. Uh, and I think it has more to do with my own personal history than the actual story of the Firebird. Because I remember one of the first, well, the first time I ever saw a movie in an omniplex was when I was a student doing my undergraduate in music education back in Dallas, Texas. And I saw Fantasia 2000. And I was not that familiar with the Firebird at that point. Uh, and if you don't know what an omniplex is, it's, it's one of those theaters that goes all the way up and around you. You're basically in a dome. And so one of the pieces in Fantasia 2000 was the Firebird. And when it gets to the part right before the Infernal Dance starts, and when the Infernal Dance starts, it goes uh, I did not know that that was coming. And the screen just exploded in color and the music exploded and I just, I literally yelled. Um, and the story in Fantasia 2000 was that of the Phoenix, which is obviously a new beginning um, because, because it's the rebirth of the bird, in this case, the firebird. Um, and that has always stuck with me. And every time we get to that point in the firebird, I just have a you know, momentary flashback to, <gasps> but then the music starts and we get going and it's, it's very fun to play. I think that the first feeling that I had was a little bit of trepidation, just thinking, I haven't been around this many people in a long time. Do I even know how to talk to people anymore? I mean, um, and everybody's wearing masks, so it's a little bit of a, a strange, uh, strange vibe. But that only lasted for a minute. I mean, I, basically the, the feeling that we got really was relief. And I think that especially after that first rehearsal started, we were doing uh, the New World Symphony. After that first rehearsal started and we started just playing music together, the feeling was just relief, joy, any good feeling you could come up with, that, that's what it was. Oh, I look forward to the electricity in the air. I look forward to the interaction. I mean, you, you know, obviously everybody in the audience can see us, but we can actually see them too. And so I see sometimes people cry, sometimes people smile, sometimes people frown, depending on what is happening up on stage. And I miss that interaction, especially from, the, from where I sit back further in the stage, I can see the, the balcony is the best. And I, when I have, especially, especially when I have um, extended rests and I have a chance to just sort of admire other people admiring the music, that's one of my favorite things. Because um, I know how just listening to music makes me feel. Um, and I hope that they feel the same way and I'm glad that we can provide that. Thank you for tuning in. And we hope that we'll be able to see you live in person sooner than later. Um, now we know that there are some vaccines coming and possibly, you know, you never know when it could be. We're, everything is sort of day by day, but the sooner the better. We would love to see everyone here. In the meantime, we'll keep making our music here and sending it out to you on the internet. And I hope that everyone's well and enjoy the music. Thank you.